n equivalent to 41 power 4 plus 31 power 4 minus of 21 power 4 plus 11 power 4. Now, see here, most of the students will open this bracket and try to solve. That will take a lot of time. Now, what we'll do is, we'll play with the options. 42, 65, 30, 20, 65 and 20. Now, the best way to solve this question is to apply Chinese reminder theorem. Chinese reminder theorem states write the number as a product of co primes. When numerator is divided by denominator, express a denominator as a product of co primes. Let me take 42. Product of co primes. I can write it as 7 into 6 or 3 into 14. Right? So instead of taking 42, I will apply a little bit of smartness. I will try to take 65. If 65 is incorrect, option B and option E both are eliminated. If I use 42, 42 is incorrect, only one option is incorrect. So I will start with 65. 65 is 5 into 30. If I divide by 5, 5 eggs are 40, 1, 1 power 4, 1, 5 6 are 30, 1, 5 4 are 20, 1. 5 2 are 10, 1. 2 minus 2, 0. Reminder 0. That means it is divisible by 5. Then it is divisible by 13. 13 3s are 13, 9. 2 power 4. 13 2s are 26. 5 power 4. 13 2s are 26. Minus 5. Minus 5 power 4 is 5 power 4. 13 1s are 13. Minus 2 power 4. It is 2 power 4. Plus minus divisible. It is divisible by 5 and 13. That means answer will be either B or E. E. What is that value? 20. 20 is 5 into 4. Already I did by using 5. You don't need to solve like this also. By looking at the question itself, you can say that the number is divisible by 20. Because A power n minus B power n is always divisible by A minus B. As long as n is a natural number. A power n minus B power n is always divisible by A minus B as long as n is a natural number. So 41 minus 21, 20, 31 minus 11, 20. It is divisible by 20. Even if you want to go by this method, 20 is 5 into 4. Already I did by using 5. 4. 4 tens are 40. 4 eights are 32, 1. 4 fives are 21. 4 threes are 12, 1. 2 minus 2, 0. It is divisible by 5, 13 and 4. Therefore, answer is divisible by 20. 65 and 20. Now, the students who said 65 as the answer, by looking at the question itself, you will get 20, right? Right? First one, 65 and 20. Now, my intention is not to solve this problem. Whenever you get reminder kinda problems, you will first make use of answer options. If it is not possible, then you will make use of traditional methods. Write the second problem. Write the second. Don't open the product, open the bracket and try to show your mathematical intelligence. You will win over the problem, and, but you will lose the game. I did not solve 42 because 42, even if I get the answer also, only 20 percentage probability is there that it might be hit. I will be little. Right? Be careful by using answer options. Wherever reminder problems are there, please make use of answer options first. In case if you are unable to solve it or if you are getting more than one answer, then you will go to the traditional method.
place and on the go. Come, let us go the other way in learning. Download our revolutionary app for free AMC.